I started off wig styling and revamping as a hobby, but today I have it as an extra stream of income from the comfort of my home. This has helped my finances tremendously, giving me the opportunity to meet amazing women and make them look good and confident, plus so much more. If you would like to hear about my journey into the wig styling and revamping business, then stay tuned and keep watching while I style a client's wig. <music> Restore us, Lord God Almighty. Make your face shine on us that we may be saved. Psalm 80, verse 19. Hello, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today, we're going to be having a story time about how I started my wig revamping business and all the tea on how beneficial being a wig revamp specialist and wig stylist has, you know, been for me personally and my finances. If you'd like to get all the tea, then stay tuned and keep watching. My journey into the wig styling and revamping business did not start until late 2020. Prior to that period, I would make my own wigs style them and revamp them if needed i already had a small business retaining synthetic hair extensions by u.s brands it wasn't long before people started to ask me if i was able to style and revamp their wigs for them because they saw how beautiful my wigs always looked whenever i go out this youtube channel was also already up by the time i i was starting out and i was posting some of my wig styling videos which further showed that i had it pinned for wigs the demand made me to start considering starting it as a business guys and before long i had set up my wig styling page qb beauty lounge on social media and started to showcase my work doing this got me more awareness and clients as well as referrals and most of my clients are repeat customers one thing i can tell you for free is that wig styling and revamping is very therapeutic for me even though a lot of my clients consider it tedious i would rather not do it and that is my first tip i'll be sharing to start a wig styling and revamping business you must have a passion for it just like anything else you do in life this passion is what will keep you going even when things are slow or when you encounter any difficulties. There are some times when I receive some clients' wigs that I would be shocked at, at how unkept, you know, those wigs look. But because I'm able to see the possibility of what I can transform them to, I get all excited and before you know it, the wig is back to being new. I'm sharing my story because I know there'll be other women like me who are interested in starting a wig styling business or just want an extra source of income but don't know how to go about it. So if you're one of such women watching this video, then you're in luck because I'm offering a free discovery call to help you gain clarity, discuss where you're at and what's stopping you while I share some guidance from my years of experience to help you. Now, when it comes to wig styling and revamping, you also need to be very intentional about the products that you use. But before you even talk about products, it is important you learn how to differentiate the different kind of hair extensions that are out there in the market. Now, when your clients bring your wigs to you, you always have to put a disclaimer out there, depending on what they want you to do, you know, um, on their wigs. If it's a regular, very good quality, you know, human hair wig, then you probably won't have any problem with the wigs like that but if it is like a very bad quality hair then you want you, you already know what you're dealing with and sometimes unfortunately you cannot even tell until you start working on the hair and that is why most times from my experience i find that most of the problems come from the closure or the lace frontal because the hair extensions that they use on those um on the lace frontal or closure are usually not as high quality as the bundles on the wig or the hair on the wig in most cases and i'm beginning to think maybe the reason why they probably do that is because they have to use very lightweight hair on the lace um compared to the bundle since it's just the weft they're attaching to the wigs but anyways you just have to be very careful when you're you know working with customers and ensure that you don't get into any trouble with damaging people's wigs i remember one of the incidents that i had and that is one of the videos that still made my channel go viral till today um somebody had given me a wig and she, she was very confident it was good human hair wig and i said okay i decided to start to revamp it like i would revamp my other kind of human hair wigs quote and unquote only for me to use the microwave method on this wig and you guys this wig literally shrunk i'm going to link that video somewhere in this video so that you guys can go and watch it if you're interested in seeing what i went through to get that wig back you know so the state's better than the state it was before, you know, when my customer brought it to me. So the, that further goes to say that you need to be very, very intentional and careful when you're taking, you know, clients wig so that you don't get into any issues with them. And there was another incident I had where I was coloring the client's wig and that wig, she wanted to lift it from black to blonde. I had told her that it wasn't going to be very, you know, okay. That would have been better if we just got like a 613 um wig now don't get me wrong i'm not saying that you can't you can't take the risk and color but most times it's just easier to just tint 
an already blonde wig than lifting from black because what for one of the things it's going to do is that it's going to reduce the quality of that hair so if you know that you're not very good it's okay to tell your clients that i can't handle this it is better you do that than to get into trouble and damage their hair because i mean they could tell you they got it at one million or or five hundred dollars and then you have to start looking for how to get a replacement for them which was what happened with my other client i had to get her another you know wig to compensate her and I had to color it to her taste you know but it didn't feel good because we couldn't give her i couldn't give her what she wanted so instances like that will come up but would that stop me from being a wig stylist or um, wig revamp specialist no i love this so i'm going to keep going i'm not going to give up so that's another thing i want to tell you that you need to make sure that you're very very confident and determined about what you do so like in this video this week that was sent to me by my clients as you can see i started off with the bundles um and you know started to i i had to use the sewing machine to sew the wig on the bundles on the wig and then i had to you know make the bundles into a wig and after that i made that into um the style that you're seeing right now so that's those are one of the benefits of being a wig stylist and you know if you're good at revamping and stuff you give your clients you know your their old wigs a new lease of life you give them something to be confident about they will, they will get real value for their money that they invested in their hair extensions because you guys know that these extensions can be pretty expensive especially the good quality ones so it's just it's just a very very fulfilling um a very very fulfilling um job or should i say business to do because you're actually helping people um you're giving them a reason to be happy you're giving them a reason to be confident and the better you are at it the you know the better for your customers too because they'll be able to refer you to their friends and they'll be able to keep coming back to you so you have to make sure that you're using the best products you know that you can um you have to make sure that you're putting in your best you have to make sure that you're very creative that your creative juice is flowing very well and you're able to give you know your 100 percent to this for me like i said earlier on it's very therapeutic so i don't even see it as a problem um styling wigs and another angle is you know installing these wigs on your clients if you know you want to go into wig installation so that when people come and sit on your chair and then you install the lace frontal and you style it for them you know that's another very good um job oppo um, business opportunity i don't like keep saying job guys that's another very good um business opportunity that you can take on now you can do both like i tell most people you can actually have both of them running simultaneously you could be um install people's wig which is still falls on that wig styling and least frontal you know installation and then you can also revamp people's wigs that means they don't sit on your chair you just fix it for them and then they take it home so you can have both you know depending on what you want to achieve but to be honest this has really really helped my finances like i mentioned earlier on um it has become like an extra source of income and i just have to you know it's very flexible and the more people know you the more publicity you you know you do the more publicity you get would help to drive more traffic to to you to be able to get more jobs and the more you do it the better you get at it so yeah so i'm just using this video to encourage anybody who is watching that you know if you have a passion for wigs then you can consider this as an extra source of income or a full-time job especially for like my stay-at-home moms like me who just want something that they find fulfillment in doing and that would still give them the opportunity to be at home and raise their children and you know be the wives and all that at home this is a very very good um job um business sorry i keep saying job guys this is a very good business that you can do on the side that is really going to help you you know be your own boss and give you i mean you never know where this can even take you to people charge a lot people charge as much as two thousand dollars guys to train you on how to install a lace frontal for five hours like make that make sense and then these classes get filled up so fast and like i was telling one of the um one of the ladies that came on a call with me um to to take advantage of the free consultation i'm offering discovery call rather than offering one of the things that she mentioned was that one of the things i told her story was that consider wigs consider that wigs are like clothes right now because when you take your clothes to a dry cleaner's place to launder it is exactly the same thing when people bring their wigs for you to revamp because wigs are technically like clothes like some people have up to 30 40 50 60 wigs and after they wear them after a couple of times they need to put back the curls they need to you know maybe change the style they need to put some coloring in 
So, and, and that is where you make your money. The more they bring these weeks to you, the more money you make. That is the whole concept. So I was telling, I said, just imagine that wigs are like clothes and they're going nowhere. As long as we wear clothes as ladies, we're always going to need wigs. Wigs are gradually becoming like, you know, like an accessory. And the wig industry is blowing up, guys. It's estimated by, that by 2030, the wig industry is going to be going into billions of dollars. Okay, so that's to tell you that the wig business hair extension business generally is going nowhere so now is a good time to pitch in take advantage and the sky is big enough for everybody i always tell that to everybody that cares to listen that regardless of how many people are doing what you're doing already there is always going to be room for you in short the more saturated the business is that is an indication that that business is thriving so if you you shouldn't let oh everybody's doing it already or you know sometimes people don't even buy People don't buy into your product or your services. They buy into your personality. So if you have an amazing personality and people love you for who you are, the, the tendency is that they might have other people who do the same thing, but they'd rather come to you to do it. So there's always market for everybody. And like I said, it's a very good um, um, business. I know I've said that like one million times, guys, bear with me. It's a very good business. And again, you know, it depends on your location too, because you might have a location, you might be at a location where nobody, nobody, there are no people doing wig revamping, nothing, nothing like that in your location. There might there are actually locations that they won't have such people. And there'll be people who have wigs and will be like, oh my goodness, where can I send this wig to? Who can help me fix my wigs and or oh, where can I get my hair installed? So if you've been thinking of, oh, what business can I do? What side hustle can I do? Especially if you're a stay-at-home mom, then this is a sign for you to sign up for my free discovery call let us talk about the challenges that you're having let us explore the possibilities as well that you have becoming a wig specialist you know and revamp stylist specialist so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video um back to this week that i'm styling what do you guys think uh <laughs> i i really really love the way this week turned out although it was a lot of hair but i love the the fact that the curls looked really amazing at the end of the day my clients really loved it i wanted something that she could just throw on her head and be ready to go so that was why i decided to create this particular look and it turned out really nice um i used a coiling wand to create the curls of course i had to use got to be glue to you know lay the the frontal before packing it up because i was like you can see i was trying to achieve um i was trying to achieve the up down hairstyle so and that is one hairstyle that is always 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 very very fabulous when ladies wear them so yeah so that'll be all for today guys i hope this video has been able to inspire somebody um who has been contemplating or who is who has been thinking like what can i do as a side hustle this is your sign girl to start you know a wig styling or revamping business and you will be glad you did i also added a free ebook for anyone who is interested in starting the link will be in the description box below so yeah see you ladies see you besties see you friends see you guys in my next video thank you for watching and stay blessed and beautiful bye